Sermons are brought to you by Moss Service and Hansville Funeral Home. Service. On Canal 61 of Falkville will be this afternoon at 4 p.m. at Hopewell Church of God in Hansville. The family will receive friends at the church Moss Service is directing. Funeral services for Reverend Marvin Doc Bryan, 81, of Cullman, will be this afternoon at 2 p.m. at Jones Chapel, First Baptist Church. He will lie in state from 1 until 2. Burial will be in Jones Chapel Cemetery. Moss Service is directing. Funeral service for Janetta Fell Sharpton, age 88, will be this afternoon at 2 p.m. at St. Andrew's United Methodist Church. Interment in Cullman City Cemetery. Cullman Heritage Funeral Home is in charge. Funeral service for Lowell Keith Wally Allen, age 64 of Cullman, will be tomorrow, Wednesday, at 11 at Mount Zion Baptist Church. Interment in Welty Cemetery. Visitation will be this evening from 5 to 8 at Cullman Heritage Funeral Home. Funeral service for Ronald Lee Powell, age 70, will be tomorrow, Wednesday, at 2 p.m. at Moss Service Funeral Home Chapel. Interment will be in Hamby's Chapel Cemetery. Visitation will be this evening from 6 to 9 at Moss Service Funeral Home. Funeral service for Alice Irene Kugler, age 105, of Hansville, will be tomorrow, Wednesday, at 2 p.m. at the Kingdom Hall of Jehovah's Witnesses in Cullman. Visitation will be this afternoon from 4 to 6 p.m. at Hansville Funeral Home. Memorial graveside services for Doris June Jacobs, age 78 of Vinemont, will be announced later by Moss Service Funeral Home. Visitation will be this evening from 5.30 until 9 at Moss Service Funeral Home. Funeral service for Audrey Kathleen Herrick will be Thursday at 11 at Grace Episcopal Church. She will be interned in the church's columbarium. Cullman Heritage Funeral Home is in charge of arrangements. Funeral services for Shirley Ann White, age 77 of Hansville, will be Thursday at 1 p.m. at Moss Service Funeral Home Chapel, interment in Hopewell Cemetery. Visitation will be tomorrow, Wednesday, from 6 to 9 at Moss Service Funeral Home. And those are our obituaries for today, brought to you by Moss Service and Hansville Funeral Home. I'm Jay Mullins with Premier Bank. And I'm Jacob Mullins. For more than 26 years, we've been providing friendly personal banking services to the citizens of Coleman and surrounding counties. We continue to provide new and improved services to our customers, and we even have a new look. So come by and see us at any of our nine convenient locations. And remember, the same friendly personal service, and we're open on Saturdays. Life lived in black and white is not a life lived. Today, I choose color. To see it. To feel it. To be in it. To be upon it. And to live a life surrounded by it. Today, I put on a fresh coat. Might not be out yet, huh? Yeah, not right.
It is Tuesday, February the 24th, and Premier Bank brings you today on to school is normal today. Yes, I saw the school Regular bus. Regular starting time. <laughs> I saw the school bus picking up. The, as I go down my road, there's a school bus That's that passes. That's the first time in a week, isn't I it? I know, I know. Uh-huh. But However, tomorrow I was going to say, <laughs> might not be working tomorrow. <laughs> oh, wow. What a week it has been for mm -hmm. the schools. And, uh, yeah. Well, anybody dealing with anything with the weather, that's right. for sure. Uh, roads coming in, okay for you? Fine with me. A little bit of sleet this morning. I mean, at my yeah. house, but then when I got on the roads, you know, the nothing really. The only thing really. that I saw, the uh, Katoma Bridge on 157 was a little icy. Oh. But you would expect. I uh, went over 278 yeah, Bridge, and uh -huh. that was okay, so. so. Other than that, roads are in pretty good shape this morning. Yes. Well, let's start with the weather forecast brought to you by Mitch Smith Chevrolet on Cherokee Avenue. The average high temperature is now 59, up oh, another yeah. degree. The <laughs> average low, 38. The record high, 77 in 2007. The record low, 14 in 1967. Sunset will be at 539. Sunrise tomorrow at 621. There you can see the mess that went through yesterday mm. and last night. Mm -hmm. And it's going to give us a break for, what, 24 hours maybe? <laughs> well, you know, maybe a little I, more than that. I talked to Derek and I asked him, I said, are you ready for more snow? He said, oh, I hope not. I'm so tired. <laughs> <laughs> He's really been shoveling that snow. No. Here's our forecast for today. It'll still be cool and cloudy, a high of 42, but no precipitation in the forecast. For tonight, overnight low of 26, and then tomorrow, 80% chance oh. of snow, snow, sleet, rain, yeah. freezing rain, a little bit of everything, a high of 36. I guess the only thing we don't know is when will it arrive. Right. Well, I had heard on the radio this morning, two to four inches, but I don't know yep, if that's true I, or I not. I heard that too, and uh, starting, I've heard it starting at noon, I've heard it saying starting in the morning, so oh, okay. uh, just be aware tomorrow, mm -hmm. uh, sometime during the day, and then things will start to improve. Thursday, we'll see some sunshine with a high of 42, Friday's high 38, Saturday 47, Sunday 55, and Monday 61. All right. Ooh. <laughs> weather in Alabama. That's right. In the winter. Don't like it? Stick around. It will change. <laughs> That's right. Give it a day or two. Yes. One thing nice about when you get snowfall here this time of year, it's usually gone within 24 hours. Oh, yeah. Yeah. We mm -hmm. don't have to shovel much yeah, snow. That's, that's right. Anything. Up north, you're going to have it for another month. Oh, yes, at least. <laughs> yeah, Poor things. Something like that. Yeah. Okay, Facebook friend for today. Who's our friend today? Joyce Nix. Hey, we, know we know Joyce. Joyce. Yeah, and she likes Jim and Nick's Barbecue and Survivor. Oh, Survivor S starts, I think, <coughs> tomorrow night. Oh, all right. Well, guess what? We're going to give her a large barbecue sandwich from Mad Dog Mike's Famous Barbecue. She can try something different other than Jim and Nick's. And she just needs to come out here first, pick up that certificate. Okay, yep. who's our guest for today? Well, Mr. Billy Troutman is here, and of course he is with the Career Center, which is, they've got always exciting things. I think yep. that's the that's one of the best kept secrets in Coleman. Mm -hmm. If you don't know anything about it, stay tuned, because we're going to tell you all about it. Okay, we'll be right back and talk to Billy. In the nation, the safest feature in your car is you. Add Vanishing Deductible from Nationwide Insurance and get $100 off for every year of safe driving. Just another way we put members first, because we don't have shareholders. Join the nation. Nationwide is on your side. Yeah, yeah. Hi, I'm Jay Mullins with Premier Bank. And I'm Jacob Mullins. For more than 26 years, we've been providing friendly personal banking services to the citizens of Coleman and surrounding counties. We continue to provide new and improved services to our customers, and we even have a new look. So come by and see us at any of our nine convenient locations. And remember, the same friendly personal service, and we're open on Saturdays. 
overwhelmed by home refinancing offers from telephone solicitors and direct mail advertising and then find you're not qualified for a specific plan? The Mortgage Center, a hometown lender, compares the rates from all home loan lenders and the qualifications of the various government programs to find a plan best suited to you. The Mortgage Center helps Coleman County people purchase and refinance their homes. This is Pat Moody. Call us today and let us tailor a loan program to your specific needs and requirements. As we mentioned, our guest today is Billy Troutman. Billy is the Assistant Director at the Career Center. Billy, am I safe saying the Career Center is the fastest growing school in the county? Well, I believe that'd be right. We have certainly had a had a, a pretty pretty vast improvement in, in student numbers over the last few years. Yes, you have. Uh, uh, well, what's new? Well, I tell you, over the last three years, we've actually had, we've added three new programs. Uh, two years ago, we, had a, we added a junior ROTC program. Mm -hmm. uh, last year, we started a pre-engineering program. And this year, we started a mechatronics program. So Mechatronics. Yep. Okay, robotics and things like that? Mechatronics is kind of a, is a unique uh, program. It's really a, it's a great mix of all the industrial arts. Uh, there is robotics. Uh -huh. There's pneumatics. There's hydraulics. There's, there's anything that's really this, this involved around the industrial maintenance type sector. And we have so much of that right now, Absolutely. don't we, with the car industries that we Absolutely. have here. And, mm -hmm. and so they need employees that have some sort of background yep. knowledge on that. Yep. Well, cool. That's great. Now, who comes up with these new programs? Well, well, you just mentioned it. Mm -hmm. I mean, uh, we work really close with our business and industry partners. Uh, we re work real close with the economic development. And so, and in education, bottom line is our mission is, is to prepare students for, for life and for opportunities. Uh, and, and right here locally, and we've already talked about the last 15 years, we've had such an industrial growth mm -hmm. that there's a need and there's a demand for, for skilled workers right here. And so then that's our mission. Mm -hmm. And so absolutely, the, the, the folks from business and industry have, have a huge input. And they're the reason why we have Megatronics right now. Right. And I know you have a culinary department. Absolutely. There. Are you Absolutely. still serving lunch on Thursday? Every Thursday. Okay. Every and that's, Thursday. that's something else people need to understand that you you know the students are preparing a meal right. on Thursday and you can just stop in, right? Absolutely. You don't have to have a reservation Absolutely. or anything and pay for your meal. What mm -hmm. typically what does that cost? Seven dollars a plate okay. and and, it, and each week it depends. You okay. know the best way to find out what we're having is to literally just stop by the school. I mean uh, just call the school mm -hmm. or look on the website or something and just kind of right. see what the menu is for the day because changes every week. Right. And we actually even had a meeting out there Absolutely. before, mm -hmm. which was great because there was a big cafeteria area that where we That's had right. a meeting. That's right. And it was prepared for us and they did an excellent job and these kids are our future chefs That's and right. our future kitchen workers and things like that. So this is mm -hmm. fantastic. I think the Career Center is just like, like I say, the best kept secret in Coleman. Well. It's great because we were talking before and, you know, college isn't for everybody. That's right. And even when people do go through college, sometimes they still can't find a job. Mm -hmm. And so these are hands-on type careers that these students can take with them, go on to maybe a trade school mm -hmm. or a technical school or something to get maybe a couple mm -hmm. more years and get really, uh, and they can also try it out this way. Yes. You know, yes. you go through high school and you go through this and you go, ah, that's not for me. I don't like that. Well, at mm -hmm. least you don't waste all that money in college figuring that out after four years, <laughs> you know. That's exactly so right. So it's a great, great benefit. You have other uh, course categories as well. Oh, we do. We do. We've got 15 programs. I've already mentioned several of them. Uh, and, and something that I'm really excited about as well, too, our health science program uh, for the first year, this year our, we're going to have six seniors that are, are leaving school with the CNA certificate. Oh, and wow. so then all of our programs credential now it doesn't matter what program you're in we have a mm -hmm. there's going to be an industry recognized credential that's available to any student uh, and and even the health science students have always had a chance to they've, they've done internships they do job shadow they I mean they do their clinical experience so they're they're leaving with a set of skills but now they're actually and, and you know they've all they've all been able to get CPR certified and things like that right. but the CNA is really I mean that's a that's a standalone certificate that means possible job right out of high school yeah that is fantastic so we're excited about that yeah because some people can't afford to That's go exactly to college. Right. They have got to get out and, and get into that workforce. Yep. And yep. so this is a fantastic opportunity. It is. It's, and, and I think it's, I think every single program has opportunity because every single program, uh, our teachers are, you know, they're industry professionals. And so they're really, they're content specialists. When, I mean, if you, if you, the best way to learn how to weld is to, to, to learn from a, a welder. The best way to learn how to, if you're going to be a doctor, a physician, or anything in the health science industry, you know, you're learning from a, from a, from a registered nurse. And right. so, right. so, so I think there's the opportunity is <laughs> huge. 
and I think the interest has really grown uh, and I think that we've I think that just we're just in a really good place. Mm -hmm. There's so. also a horticultural department. Horticultural as well. department. And you sell plants, right? Absolutely. In the Absolutely. And the spring sales will be coming up soon too. Yeah, I thought they would. I know as far as geraniums <coughs> and bedding plants, tomatoes, peppers, he usually has Mr. Moore does a great job. He'll have mm -hmm. tons of stuff out there ready to go. Right. At good prices. At good prices. Yeah. Very, very good prices. Yeah. That's right. And it gives the kids an opportunity to, to learn how to grow things and Absolutely. stuff like that. So it's just a fantastic opportunity really for is. kids in high school. You have an open <laughs> house this That's week. That's exactly why I'm here. This coming Thursday, uh, we're going to start at 5 and go to whenever because we're not going to run anybody out if we're doing tours or whatever. Okay. But from around 5 to 7, we just like to invite the community out. We're, go we're certainly having an open house. Uh, February is Career Tech Month, and that's that's one the one way we celebrate is by having a good open house. Uh, last year's open house was a huge success, and uh, we had over 100 folks come through and just visit the different various shops and stuff. Our teachers will be there. We'll have some students on site that'll help kind of guide around and ask questions. Mm -hmm. uh, if you have questions for them, uh, there'll also be some light refreshments as well. So, okay. so our culinary guys will probably bake up some cookies and right. things like that to have. So, good deal. Good so deal. we're very excited about that. We sure are. And real quick, like, just who exactly can go to this career? Center. Everybody. We, you know, potential students, parents that are interested and in, in just kind of wondering what opportunities are out there. Uh, you know, current students and families, just visitors from the community, business, we don't care. Mm -hmm. this, it's an open house, and so we just want you to be there. But who can actually go to the career center? Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry, sorry my students. To actually go to school. Yes, school we, we start serving students in the 10th grade. Okay. And so we have sophomores, juniors, and seniors right now that are on campus. And so. And this is city and county? Absolutely, okay. city and county. That's okay. absolutely right. And so we've got a great partnership with our city school system. And so, we, and they've obviously sent wonderful students. And we're happy to have them. And where are you located? Just Highway 31 North, right across from the uh, right across from the Ag Center, okay. and right across from Sports Fit, the, the exercise place up okay. there, right there on the right. On the right, headed north. Yep. So very that's good. It. Okay, and that's Thursday night, starting at Thursday night, starting at five o'clock. Five o'clock. Okay. Mm -hmm. Wonderful. Thank well, you. Well, thank you so thank much. Thank you, Billy. Sure. We'll be back with more right after this. As soon as you've conquered Coco Vin, there's chocolate to souffle, there's baklava to build from scratch, and Bernays to top epic fillets. There is you and your guts, and heat that you can trust. KitchenAid Even Heat technology gives you incredible control over sauteing, melting, and simmering, and the most even baking across all racks. And when everything you try turns out, there's so much more to make. I remember the moment. I'll never forget that moment. That moment? It was a moment that changed my life. I'd been training with my team for months, and now we had been called up for the first time. The real deal. Wildfires were getting dangerously close to homes. At that moment, I got my first taste of just how important the Guard is to my community. See how the Guard can be an important part of your life at NationalGuard.com. Hi, I'm Jay Mullins with Premier Bank. And I'm Jacob Mullins. For more than 26 years, we've been providing friendly personal banking services to the citizens of Coleman and surrounding counties. We continue to provide new and improved services to our customers, and we even have a new look. So come by and see us at any of our nine convenient locations. And remember, the same friendly personal service, and we're open on Saturdays. We continue with more of Today on 2, this part of our program. We have some prizes we sure would like to give away. Let's see what we have for prizes for today. We have a free haircut, courtesy of Hair by Loretta. We have two cupcakes from Frosting's Bakery. And we have the bag of assorted apples from Steel Orchard. Those are the prizes. Here we go with the ads. We'll ask you a question, of course, about one of these merchant ads. And we start today with Steel Orchard. Check out their baked items. They have the highest quality products at the lowest possible price since 1985 on County Road 1141. And the Red Velvet Blizzard is the blizzard of the month right now at Dairy Queen. Stop by today, check that out. Check out their lunch specials. They have some great lunch specials at Dairy Queen. Be Fit, fitness facility located right downtown. All you pay is $50 a month. No long-term contract. You just pay month to month and you get a personal trainer. 
And Mad Dog Mike's Famous Barbecue is featuring that family pack for just $14.99. That includes a pound of meat, two 16-ounce sides, four buns, located right there inside the Berlin Quick Stop. Mad Dog. Done right taxes and bookkeeping services there on 9th Avenue Southwest. A little bit uh, across the street north of the city cemetery, open 8 to 5 Monday through Friday and 8 till noon Saturday. Coleman Wellness and Aquatic Center, another play, great place to go to get fit. They have the indoor leisure pool, whirlpool spa, aerobic and cycling classes all the time at Coleman Wellness and Aquatic Center. Berkeley Bob's Coffee House and Whole Earth Store has organic, fair trade and shade grown coffees, live folk music. Earl's Body Shop voted best automotive repair in Coleman, large and small towing available local or long distance 24 hours day at Earl's Body Shop. Chesley Oaks Golf Course open seven days a week. They have four sets of tees to suit your ability. They're on <coughs> County Road 1583 in Fairview. There we go with the merchant ads for today. Question for today, see if you can remember something we've used for a long, long time. Which of our advertisers says they've been in business for over 50 years? All right. Should know that one. A lot of them that we have probably have been, yes. but one specifically mentions it in, in the ad. ad. Yeah. They've been in business over 50 years, so mm -hmm. tell us who we're talking about. Get a free haircut from Loretta. You get um, cupcakes. cupcakes from Frostings. And, and a bag of apples. bag of apples from Steel Orchard. Healthy and not so healthy. <laughs> See, you're fair and balanced. Yes, that's that right. 256-734-7399 yes. is our telephone number. Go ahead and give us a call while we watch Money Matters, brought to you by Premier Bank. I'm Caitlin with Premier Bank, and this is Allison Lewis. She's our Good Hope Office Manager. Today, Allison's going to tell us a little bit about what it takes to get a car loan. I want to talk to the young people out there who are approaching their 16th birthday and they're thinking about purchasing their first car. One thing that you may not know is that most institutions do require a down payment, which is a percentage of the purchase price paid in cash by you. And the more your vehicle costs, the more your down payment's going to be. So as you approach your 16th birthday, be thinking about how you can save your money so that you'll be prepared to pay your down payment. If you have any questions, you can stop by her Good Hope office and see Allison, or you can come by any of our other eight locations or give us a call at 256-737-9900. Thanks, and we hope to see you soon. I think we might have stumped everybody today. I guess Again, so. the question we have, if you want to give us a quick call, tell us which of our advertisers mentions on the ad they have been in business for over 50 years. 256-734-7399 is our telephone number. Let's look at that ad and the rest of our merchant ads right now. Berkeley Bob's Coffee House and Whole Earth Store, live folk music, baked goods and smoothies. Check out Open Mic Night here on Channel 2. And of course, entertainment coming up, Eric Summer, Rockabilly on Friday night. And Deb's Bookstore, it's your hometown bookstore just down the road where browsers are always welcome. Gift certificates are available, used books half price off every day, new books 20% off every day at Deb's Bookstore. Mr. Hicks Menswear and Formal Wear, Coleman's only men's specialty store for suits and sport coats. It's getting to be prom season, tuxedo rentals available at Mr. Hicks Menswear. And Grand Point Pharmacy, where they have coffee and gifts. Kids can now choose the flavor of their medicines. We make managing your prescriptions easy because managing your health is hard enough. And that's their slogan at Grand Point Pharmacy. Hair by Loretta. Loretta is the color specialist, but she does hair care for the entire family. Now located in the Bella Fair Day Spa and Salon. Frosting's Bakery, and they're, of course, now serving soup on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Check that out, especially on a cold day today. Like today, that would be awesome. At Frosting's Bakery. Mullins Body Shop, look at here, in business over 50 years, doing auto body repair, service and towing, you can still count on them today. Cotton State Barns, where you can buy or rent to own, no credit check, you're approved, they've got carports, play sets, utility trailers, storage buildings at Cotton State Barns. Pizza Hut has the all-you-can-eat lunch buffet featuring a new pizza every day and you pay just $5.99. 
Serve from 11 till 2. Tires for less. More than just tires. Open Monday through Friday from 7.30 till 5. Go see Greg and the guys located right there on Highway 31 North. Liberty Tax Service has two locations, one in Coleman, one in Hansville, and they have products and tax service with real benefits. Make your appointment today. That's Liberty Tax Service. There we go with the merchant ads. We'll take a break and come back and look at our community billboards and birthdays and anniversaries right after this. Hi, I'm Jay Mullins with Premier Bank. And I'm Jacob Mullins. For more than 26 years, we've been providing friendly personal banking services to the citizens of Coleman and surrounding counties. We continue to provide new and improved services to our customers, and we even have a new look. So come by and see us at any of our nine convenient locations. And remember, the same friendly personal service, and we're open on Saturdays. With classic bolognese behind you, there are racks of lamb ahead. There are tartlets to take on and crazy knife skills to perfect. There is you and your muse, the appliance brand more chefs choose. Chefs choose KitchenAid for their homes more than any other brand. And when every machine does incredible things, there's so much more to make. Time for our community billboards brought to you by Pepsi and Coleman Jefferson Gas. The annual Arbor Tree Sale is taking place for on Wednesday, the, that's this Wednesday, and that's going to be at the Civic Center. Many varieties are available like shade trees and trees for wildlife and ornamental shrubs for landscaping. Go check that out. Get it's, there early. Okay, yeah, that's true. <laughs> those, Get there early tomorrow. They, those trees go fast. <laughs> and Wallace State Singers are presenting uh, the Disney Through the Decades on Friday and Saturday at the Betty Lee Haynes Theater. That's at 7 o'clock in the evening. Tickets are just $7 for adults and $5 dollars for students kids five and under are free and the rotary auction will be taking place this Friday at the Civic Center viewing of items and the silent auction begins at 430 live auction at 650 all proceeds benefit local charities and Wallace State Alumni Charity Bash is taking place. That's the Little Black Dress. That's this Saturday. Top of the Town starts at 6 o'clock. Doors open at 5.30. Tickets are $75 per person. For more information, you can give them a call, 256-352-7808. And Coleman Walking Club is meeting Monday, March the 2nd from 9 to 11 at Beach Center, located right there behind Handy TV. Cost is $10 per month. Proceeds go to help CCCDD. And the Smithsonian Traveling Exhibition is uh, located right there in the Evelyn Burrow Museum, and that's taking place now through March the 20th. That's the way we worked. Go check that out. And Here For You Tour, it's the Cornerstone Church of the Nazarene is sponsoring this on April the 17th at the Civic Center. Tickets can be purchased at itickets.com and it starts at 7 o'clock. And if you have a community billboard, you can send it to channel2coleman.com or email at channel2coleman at gmail.com. Give us a call, 256-734-7399 or look us up on Facebook at channel 2 Coleman. And we would like to wish Corey Maynard mm -hmm. a happy birthday. And her name or his name will be put into the drawing on Friday where they have that possibility of winning an ice cream cake from Dairy Queen. <clears throat> Checking the weather forecast one more time. Brought to you by Mitch Smith Chevrolet. It'll be cloudy today with a high of 42. Overnight low tonight, 26 tomorrow. We could see snow with the accumulation, they're saying, what, two to four inches yeah, maybe starting yeah. sometime tomorrow. That's our program for today, brought to you by Premier Bank.